adding in a new light onto the circuit, power turned off, just gotta butt this guy out. Put in a new box connector, need that to clamp down on the Romex and then you have to put in a staple, but that'll happen. You can see, see that exposed conductor? And this thing was like, look at that, it's like barely on. So we're gonna replace this with a Wago, tie into the new Romex and we'll also tighten it down because it's pretty loose in the old light, but that should be pretty quick and easy. So we just get our Wago, letter it on, put them all in. And rinse and repeat, gotta do that with the neutrals and then the hots and tie them into the light. All right, everything's wire nutted in the box. Just gotta get the jumpers off. But here's that old pull chain light. And uh, we're just gonna tighten up these screws cause see it's pretty loose right now and that's kind of a hazard. There we go, it's wired up. Got a staple within 12 inches. There's the light bulb, just gotta turn on the breaker and see if the other lights turn on. One light's on, let's see if the other ones are on. Boom, there we go. Four other lights came on, pretty happy.